So we're here tonight with Mandy from the Mutajulu Foundation. Um, just wanted to ask you, Mandy, whether what we've done this week, the Jimmy Little team, has helped with um, the music equipment that you, the Foundation has bought for the community. Absolutely. The guys came in last night and jammed and set up um, some of the new equipment. Yep. We had loads of people, kids and young men, playing the instruments. We've got a bigger crowd here again tonight and put on a feed that's um, you know, good and healthy, healthy yep. tucker, yep. which is awesome. Men's health program went very well. Yep. Um, I'd say it's been a huge success. So we're here with Sue from the clinic at Mutajulu. Um, I just wanted to ask you, Sue, if um, the Jimmy Little Foundation team coming up to support the men's health check has been a success? Well, I'd have to say yes, because without you coming, I certainly couldn't have done these two days of men's health checks because this is what's sort of grabbed people's attention and got them to come to the clinic and have checkups and we've actually done a lot of checks in the last two days so I'd say that I can't do it without you and I want you to come regularly. Hi Warwick, um, so we're here at Mutajulu at the health clinic. Um, yep. the, do you think the Jimmy Little Foundation activities have helped with supporting the um, men's health checks this week? Look, the way we've run it over the daytime, I don't think that it would be half as effective if it hadn't been for the Jimmy Little Foundation sort of putting the word out there, getting the guys to come into the clinic um, it's just been really nice. They're aware of what's happening, yeah. and um, no, good on you guys for doing it. We've um, come here before with varying success, but this has been a very nice um, process for us to be involved in. Yeah, and you've had like good numbers of men turn up for health check. We have, and especially in the younger age group that normally we don't see in clinics. Yeah, yeah. And I think that you know that's part of that connection with you guys, with your music and everything else. That that's who the young fellas listen to. So. They're in here, so we've seen a lot of young guys between 15 and 25 in that's the last right. few days, yeah. Yeah, no, that's a great outcome for everyone concerned with. I think from our, our perspective, I think we've been, the feeling is we've been accepted in the community, so I think it's been a win-win yeah. for all. I think so too, you know, and I'll, I'll be interested to go into the store and have a good look around and see all your work in there and um, see the benefits over the next few months. Hi, so we're here at the Ininti store at Mutajulu um, and with Susan, the store manager. And I just wanted to ask you, Susan, sure. um, we've come in to do the um, Uncle Jimmy food sale mm -hmm. and brand the store with yep. the Healthy Tucker um, branding. Um, do you think it's going to be beneficial for the community? Yes, I think so. And I would think in the last few days it has increased. It's drawing the attention of the children to the water fridges and to the healthy food fridges. Excellent. Um, so, you. Um, Hopefully when we come back, it'll, we can see an increase in more water being um, sold and definitely, more fruit and veggies. Definitely, definitely. I've noticed an increase in the fruit this week from the children. Uh, they're coming to the fridge to look at the stickers and noticing the fruit and then buying the fruit. So, yeah. so Susan, do you think that the, G the JLF team coming out to the community has been beneficial? Yes, I think it has. It's, uh, increased, in, it's increased interest in the store and in what you're doing. Um, People have noticed the stickers and that they've noticed because they've noticed your team, they're coming to see what you're doing. And, yeah, and the music it, workshops. And, and the, the music, everyone's loving the music. Yeah, yeah. that's good. No, that's yeah. what we'd love to see. And we'll yeah. be back again in the near future. No worries, thank you.